Hello and welcome back to Southeast Asia and the seventh episode of our Abdecom campaign. Um, we have just bombed a light cruiser that has escaped because it went ghost on us. Uh, and uh, here's a situation that we are going to deal with. Uh, I believe these are some destroyers, so I'm going to pay them a visit with the Martins and to get the 400 because the 250 sort of didn't seem to work very well. Um, there is a boat here which I think might be a sub and uh, I have already sent some uh, uh, fighters there. I am thinking about sending this actually slightly here because I am a bit afraid that if this moves over there uh, it could intercept here which also means that I am going to change uh, these guys a bit. Okay, I'm not entirely happy about going there, but uh, you, you do what you have to. Okay, and this one is going there, so here and there. So, uh, obviously this thing is going to Singapore, we are going to load some more troops and supplies there and uh, head back to Palembang. So, this is it, once I engage this convoy I will get back to you, or if anything else happens in the meanwhile, I'll get back to you. Okay, the Martins are in place, so let's start the run and see what have we got here. Ah. Uh, Okay, so this is the damage convoy. I am not going to pincer. I will just strike bomb. And we've got our planes coming in and let's see how good they are at hitting a perfectly stationary target. And my bet is not very good at all <sighs> and yes i know i could do manual bombing especially on the stationary target there but it's it's shooting <sighs> the fish in a barrel and um it's this way i can sort of swear and, and everything at, at the pilots and so on um and you can obviously swear at me and overall i would say we all will have slightly more fun because of the unexpected. Uh, oh yes, that was a nice one. Well, if she doesn't sink now, I don't know when she's going to sink because that was a magazine explosion if I ever saw one. Let's have a look, okay. Yeah, magazine explosion, two direct hit by bombs. She must go down. She absolutely must go down. And she's going down. Hurrah! Excellent. So, our first sortie of the mission and our first sinking. That was a nice one. Very happy. Very happy. Happy, happy, joy, joy. And uh, we've just created... The, the seafloor here is pretty barren. Boring. Uh, so we are creating artificial reefs. Uh, better for fishing, better for bay, better for sea life. Yeah, of course the oil spills and everything is not great. But uh, yeah, still, it's not very deep here. We've got our extra command point by sinking another Nagara. How much did we actually sink? Sorry, let's click. Enemy losses. We saw a big merchant, uh, one heavy cruiser, one uh, Tenryu, Minikaze destroyer, Shiratsu destroyer, a sub, and uh, Natori Nagara light cruiser. So, seven ships. We haven't lost anything uh, as in ships yet. 
but we lost 24 aircraft they've lost fewer aircraft than we did but i consider the shipping more important so as far as i'm concerned good job boys okay so we've got these things here and we are going to send some hudsons okay we are in our attack runs and let's see what we can do if anything We've got two night hits, one that's uh, caused some fires. Yeah, we'll see what we get. I don't expect. Uh, okay, three hits actually. Two dud, uh, two good hits and one dud. That's fine. We are going to retreat. As fully expected, they got it under control. Uh, so, yeah, we haven't lost anyone. It's okay. Okay, but now we have ready to launch, so we are going to launch Hurricanes. Here they come. Overflown. That was a nice hit. That could have been a magazine explosion, another one. That would have been very nice. Let's check it out. Oh uh, no, it wasn't. Unfortunately, it wasn't a magazine explosion, it was just two bombs falling next to each other. Well, uh, that's still fine. Let's have a look at the report. Heavy and heavy. Uh, and these guys can actually strike, but these ones I wouldn't send on a striping run. This one is fine to stripe let's start striping because he was turning into us so we are going to use that okay damaged we are not going to stripe anymore if assuming we'll get away well we got some nice damage on the guy Okay, they got it under control, so we are going to leave as usual. Yeah, heavy and heavy, unrepairable, fine with me. Uh, okay, we've got this near Surabaya, so we are going to send more Hudson this way. And I think uh, Trust is actually going to go this way. It's not going to go to straight. I, I don't think it's worthwhile. Okay, Hudson's. Let's start. Nice sailing. This is not going to be the best angle, but uh, who knows? Ah, oh, we've got to hit at least one. Good. Anything. 
Yeah, we've got some hits. Okay, let's leave moderate and minor. It's fine by me. Here is, ah, uh, this looks like the two CAs. Let me engage. Where is she heading? He is directly on Earth or so they are somewhere here. What is the situation? Layer at 204 feet. Silent running. Okay. We have a target. More specifically, we have a Takao class. That is coming our way. We have a very, very decent solution. So we are going to use it. Three, two, one. Fire. Okay, and let's see now, what do we get? We fired eight torpedoes uh, after the experience, obviously, with the swordfishes where the uh, Takao, or whatever it was there, uh, no, not Takao, something else, uh, <laughs> needed tons of torpedoes. to die, so here they come. Here they come. <gasps> Can they hit it? Can they hit it? Yes! We've got a few hits, quite a few. Yeah. The three hits out of eight, nah, not the best, obviously, but uh, I am happy with that. Where is the 204 feet is the layer, so let's go slightly deeper. Assuming we have depth, we, we do. How's our the cow doing? It looks pretty bad, let's face it. I wasn't sure what the spread. Um, if she sped up, it could have been, yeah, the spread could have been tighter, but uh, it's hard to say, honestly. Now we have to escape. At least one of the destroyers is basically out of commission, so. I'm fine with that. Okay, so the question is, uh, should I waste a torpedo on this thing? Uh, and I think the answer is no. He's basically dead in the water, he doesn't have anything, he's uh, 
it's just there. Uh, so I don't think he's... Uh, but one more torpedo there, one more torpedo would have probably sunk it. Slightly tighter spread would have done it. Oh well. Last look at Takao sailing away from the sun. Truant has successfully engaged the convoy and uh, yeah. And that means that we are going to send a We are going to sink that damn small thingy. And we I think we might have Yep, we are closed. Let's get us some troops and supplies and plot the course back to Helenbank. But Navia can launch, yes it can. Semi-armor piercing. Let's get here. Ten destroyers. I find it hard to believe. Well, let's have a look at this. The hurricanes will attack here. This will have a look here. Hurricanes tactical. And boom and got a hit. Okay, we are going after the plane, little float plane. You made a mistake and it's down. And you guys go wrong. Um, I am attacking only with two because one got damaged when it flew too close. So we will see what we can get with just two. And then we might strafe. Depending on how, whether we get the damage or, or not. Or Or anything. We've got damage one here, so we are going to send it away. I think we've got three undamaged planes, which means that we have just enough to go for a good striking run. rough. The funnels look very riddled. Bridge looks damaged. Critical minor acceptable. And RTB. Uh, we will take these Hudsons to have a look here whether it's really 10 destroyers uh, or one more encounter and that's going to be it for this uh, episode 7. Okay, so we've got the Martins here uh, with uh, the high explosives, uh, 250 pounders, and they are going specifically after the uh, almost sunk destroyer. And off we go. One or two hit, but they would have to hit in the first place, uh, which they did. Uh, got a direct hit by bomb and one dud, and she stopped. It's a pity. Maybe if it wasn't a dud, it uh, might have uh, might have sunk it. Turbias ready. So more bombs coming your way. UCA's two DDs. Interesting. 
more CAs. I'm really curious to see what these 10 destroyers is. Okay, so let me do this one. If it's something uh, uh, of interest, we will... Oh, shit. Clearly it is something of interest. This is a massive destroyer Pokemon. This is big. <laughs> shit. Be happy if we survive this. If we get any hits on them, that would have been plus, which we didn't. But if we survive this, this is this is sufficient. This is very very unpleasant. Then destroyers. Fuck. <laughs> That's all I can say. I do apologize for the language. Then destroyers. That's a lot. Two heavy cruisers with some support, I guess, to deal with this. But we don't have anything. Uh, <clears throat> so that and this is going to be really the last one. hits and one more hit okay I'm happy with that three three hits on the Nagara is not bad um, well, four hits really but one dud heavy upside damage minor flooding I wish that there was more flooding but you know I take what I, what I get, uh, there are no fires, so we are just going to retreat. Moderate, minor, they repaired something, fine, RTB. So that's it for today, we have some really nasty things here, those 10 destroyers, here's another CA. Potentially, we did some reasonably good damage. We had successes. Uh, we will see how we are going to do in episode 8, where I hope you will join me. Uh, this might go out just on New Year's Eve, or maybe not, it depends on how much time I will get. Uh, but regardless of that, Happy New Year to everyone watching, and uh, I hope to see you uh, in uh, next year. And uh, we'll see what that brings. Thank you for watching and goodbye.